It's time to party with the Boys and Girls Club of Evansville. Shanna Grinegar is the Director of Development and Marketing for the club. Happy yes. anniversary, birthday, all of that. Thank you. We are so excited. That is such a big deal and almost impossible to believe 65 years. It's incredible. I mean, who would have thought when we started out at a small old school house here in Evansville on Illinois Street that we would bloom into what we are today. It's, it's amazing and beyond humbled to celebrate 65 years. Was this a dream of one person? Um, it was actually a group, uh, a group of guys that got together many years ago, um, which actually started the Boys Club of Evansville at that time. Um, so it wasn't until 1991 that we joined our national office and changed our name to Boys and Girls Club. So we've been serving children, females, males since 1991 uh, and have really transformed lives of thousands upon thousands of kids from um, not only age five, but all the way up to 17. Well, and of course, we talk to you every month and see all of the energy that the club generates yeah. and the positive outcomes for those kids. So how are you going to celebrate? So we have a lot planned, um, and we are hoping that the community will join us next Wednesday, August 3rd, at the Boys and Girls Club, 700 Bellmead Avenue. We are going to have um, several different things going on. For one, um, from noon to four, uh, we are going to have outdoor activities. So we're going to have bounce houses for the kids. We're going to have the Mounted Patrol with the Evansville Police Department, the horses there. Oh, they'll love that. Which, they're beautiful. So uh, if nothing else, come out, see these horses. They are amazing. Um, we also have carnival games that we're going to have different games set up on our futsal court so kids can play. They can win prizes. Um, we have an amazing group of volunteers that are going to oversee all of this for us. We've got other youth agencies, Big Brothers, Big Sisters, the YMCA, uh, Girl Scouts. We've got a lot of different volunteers and groups that are going to be joining us. Just activities and fun for the kids. Um, Gaga Pit that's going to be on our baseball field. What, what is it, that? So a Gaga Pit from the YMCA. Um, it's, it's inflatable and it's essentially a big outdoor um, pit, if you will, that the kids can play in. It's safe. Parents don't have to worry about them going outside of the area. So um, just fun and activities that will be taking place in that on our baseball field I as well. I want to see the Gaga pit. <laughs> Come out. Everybody can see it. I have to stop by yes. to see the Gaga pit. Yes, and we're going to have door prizes. So if nothing else, please come out at 1, 2, and 3 o'clock. We're going to be drawing. We're going to be doing uh, a kid basket at 1, bicycle uh, of your choosing of size at 2 o'clock, and then an Xbox at 3 o'clock. And on top of everything else, in our gym, we're going to have a career fair. So, Which is super right now, just yes, what we need. It, it yes. is. Um, we're going to have several different industries, whether it's um, pet, whether it's uh, cars, over 20 different vendors are going to be set up in our gym. So come out from, that's from um, 12.30 to 2.30. Uh, and we've actually given our kids, our oldest kids, uh, the first half an hour of the career fair to go through it just themselves so they that's can learn awesome. more, um, set themselves up for success just as we try to do every day. Uh, and then the career fair is open to the public from 1 to 2.30. Those real life opportunities to see it what is. it's like to be hunting for a job. It well, is. thank you and happy yes. anniversary, happy birthday. Join the party. We'll see you next month. Sounds good. We'll be right back. Stay with us.